This is Thor from Tobarias.com with a homemade blueberry yogurt guide. In this video, you are going to see how to make a delicious single serving natural homemade yogurt with tasty blueberries. This is a simple and easy way to make your own healthy blueberry yogurt without the excess sugar you would find in most of the store bought yogurts. And it is a great snack for your little one. I give these to my 16 month old from time to time when my husband isn't eating them all. We will start measuring the amount of milk. I have these 125 milliliter jars that are just the right size for our family. Leave some space when filling the jars because the blueberries we will be adding to this yogurt recipe will take some of that space. When you have measured out all the milk, you will need to put it on the oven at a low to medium heat. Now for the blueberries. We will use 200 grams of frozen blueberries, 50 grams per jar. These were defrosted earlier. If you like, you can use the substitute fresh blueberries. We will blend all the blueberries until they are smooth. If you would like some blueberry pieces in your yogurt, feel free to blend it a little bit less. My daughter loves it when it is completely blended. And put this on the oven at low to medium heat as well. This is where you can decide whether or not you want to sweeten the yogurt. You can add a teaspoon of honey, maple syrup or sugar to your taste. Make sure to mix it well and turn off the heat when the blueberry mixture begins to boil. Just as you are heating up the blueberry mixture, your milk has likely started to boil. Make sure to stir while it is still on the heat. And if you prefer a thick yogurt, continue stirring for about 3 to 4 minutes after you have taken off the heat. Make sure to check out my easy homemade thick yogurt video if you need details on how to make thick yogurt. I will also include a link in the notes below. The boiled milk and warmed up blueberries should be around the same temperature. Let's let them cool down for a bit. The milk and the blueberries should be lukewarm. And it is just the right temperature, great! Now it is time to mix everything together. We will start by mixing a small amount of milk with our culture. I'm using tablespoon of yogurt I made a few days ago, but a high fat store bought yogurt would also work just well. Once mixed, we will add that to the rest of our milk and make sure to stir it well. Then we add the blueberries into the pot. As soon as it is all mixed together, we will fill the jars we used to measure with earlier and close the lid tight. Next, we wrap the jars to keep them warm for about 5 to 6 hours. I'm using a couple of blankets. After 6 hours, unwrap the jars, take off the lids and leave the jars open at room temperature for about an hour and put them open into the fridge for about 8 hours. We are leaving the jars open to reduce the chance of a soggy yogurt. Now our blueberry yogurt is ready to eat. Let's check how thick they are. See, upside down and nothing is dripping. Not a single drop. Perfect! Let's garnish with a few blueberries. You can use gloves if you don't want your fingers and nails to get all blue. Beautiful, isn't it? And finally, let's taste. Yummy! If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. We will be regularly posting new videos showing you how to make great food for your family.